Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel Super Sam 7 and today we're looking at my 54th Platinum Trophy which is in the game Life is Strange True Colors. Yes, my 51st through 54th Platinum Trophies have all been on the Life is Strange series. At least the four you can platinum, so there you go. The trophy platinum is called Heaven Maven. And now going all the way up to level 333, 13% through. I now have 3,419 trophies, 54 platinum, 175 gold, 664 silver, and 2526 bronze, or 2526 bronze. Also, uh, at this point, my points uh, on PSN profiles for getting platinum trophies has exceeded the points I got for collecting uh, gold trophies, which both have not been more than the points I've gotten by getting over 2,500 bronze trophies. If you know what I'm talking about. So let's just click into here because last time I got Life is Strange 2. I think that was in, uh, yeah, September 25th. So since then, I've gotten some more in the Super Hero Squad Infinity Gauntlet. I have finished the game or with uh, these last few levels. Played it on easy. And then I got the, uh, let's see. Completed all of the Hulk's heroic feats, completed all of Falcons, and Spider-Man's. He was the first one I did for heroic feats. I uh, got all the Rhythm Stone fragments. I just need one more Power Stone. And I got all the Mind Stone fragments. And then, of course, we already know that I got all of the, those before. Let's look at Green Lantern. Yes, I started a new game. I know I said I wasn't going to do that because I wanted to get... um. <clears throat> As many as I could, but the uh, Superhero Squad one, it just kept glitching out for me so much that I got mad and I decided to start a new one with Green Lantern. This is probably one of the easiest Platinum Trophies ever. I've played through the first five missions in uh, the hardest difficulty, which is called Emerald Knight. And as you can see, 20 hit combo, 50 hit combo, 99 hit combo. I think the highest you can go is 99 hits. The counter will stop after 99, even if you keep getting more. And then just defeating... Uh, Villains 10 times with a specific uh, L2, then press the button. Uh, sp I guess special attacks. You can see Hover Mines, Baseball Bat, Warhammer, Ring Blaster, uh, the Blade Whip, the Gatling Gun. Two, three, four, five more that I need. Defeat 20 enemies with the Mace Storm. Use Ring Surge 10 times, just pressing L1 and R1 for a power up. Launch up 20 enemies. I think I got that my first day playing. Uh, make Green Lantern dizzy. Just run around 10 times in a circle. Get up to level 5. I think when I'm playing it on uh, the hardest difficulty, I'll get up to level 10. Just by playing the game normally. Collect the meteorites. These are the hidden collectibles, these two. And then just fully upgrade is uh, these last ones, which are like all silver and then the gold one. So, Deadpool. I was able to uh, get from the studio lobby to the border without dying in 5 minutes. Take no damage on the water slide. I had to redo this like almost 20 times. I don't know why it was so hard for me. Defeat Arc Light while taking no damage. She didn't even have a chance to do her slam attack. I defeated her so fast. I'll uh, replay the level. Oh, I didn't get this one. I feel like it was so close, but that's okay. Uh, let's keep going down. Uh, just play the game. This is when I try to get everything while playing the game uh, in story mode. Or I guess my first time. Uh, let's see. Make it across the floating debris. I had to go back and do that one. Uh, die 10 times. That's kind of a hidden trophy. I had to go back and do that one as well. Put the final level. I, I'm glad I have to just replay the levels with all my upgrades on Ultra Violence, and that will still count for, um, for getting the difficulty trophies. Select the dialogue slot. Oh, I think I already showed. Oh, no, I didn't. Uh, complete a gold or silver trail challenge while countering at least 25 times. That's really easy. Uh, this is completing five gold challenges. I think four are super easy to get. There's seven available. Uh, combo an entire wave. I think that's going to be pretty easy as well. I haven't even played a gold tier challenge map, so that's probably why I haven't gotten it yet. And, of course, fully upgrade. I've gotten uh, 
11 out of 15, so that's easy. Just explode the grenade while holding it. You can do that in story mode or go back in the game and play it. 300 hit combo. Uh, like I said, I got that one earlier and it didn't count for some reason. And of course, Life is Strange True Colors. I, I think... Yeah, I finished this game. I played the last... Uh, three chapters it was a very fast game I kind of rushed through it It only took me like six hours I, I did like how it was very unique for episodes uh, three and four it wasn't really story based you could just do what you wanted around the town same thing with episode two actually uh, so yeah I just played the game got the collectibles very easy and fun Although, this might be my least favorite Life is Strange game, I'm sorry to say. I thought the second one was bad, but I'm thinking about it. I don't know. They're they're both tied for me for least good. I might like this. I'd probably just like this one more because it was shorter, if that makes sense. It was like more than two times shorter than uh, Life is Strange 2. So, there you go. Uh, the next thing I'm going to platinum for sure because the video will probably come out tomorrow on Friday the 13th. Yes, we'll talk about that on that video. Is uh, just cause two. I just gotta get the difficulty. That's it. So, I thank you for watching. And have a great day.